vlog. Gym rat Edith just got out of the gym. Duh. Sleepyhead Ricardo just was editing in the car. My hair is like all messed Ricardo up. Ricardo has been pulling through with editing these vlogs. The last two days he's been doing it. I haven't helped him at all. But you guys, I want to tell you guys a quick inspirational oh message. God. What? When you clapped all your like sweater my dust came out. <laughs> Sorry. Just because... I feel super, super good right now, but I didn't an hour ago. As you guys saw. When we went to the Christmas yes. pack, I me resfrié bien feo, and like, I was just very congested. You could probably still hear in my nasalness right yeah, now. Yeah, she did not feel good at all last night. Her muscles were all tensed up, like she was congested all night. Sometimes at night, she was honestly coughing. I don't know if you know that, I but do. you were coughing yeah. last night, and she woke up the same way, like bad. This morning, I woke up, and it wasn't like I felt like I have a fever, like that. It wasn't like that. It was just like, I just feel congested and my muscles really hurt because of the gym they just got really really stiff for some reason out of nowhere anyways i didn't want to go to the gym but i was like dude i have to because it's wednesday like i have to go with my trainer and not even that next week we're leaving to colorado and we're, she's only going to be able to go monday so i'm going to miss one day and yeah. then the rest of the week i'm not going to be able to go to the gym period so i was like let me just go i'm going to try to take it slow i'm going to tell my trainer that i feel congested to like probably <clears> like do stuff down. but like yeah not so intense so i go and she makes me do something harder than i've ever done before on the treadmill which is not really that hard but technically i jog and i've never jogged on the treadmill at that personal training gym. Yeah. and then the whole workout i was doing so good like all of the lifts and everything it was like the highest weight i've ever done and i did them like easily like a break not a brace obviously it was hard but like compared to day one dude i was doing 20 pound weights and like all this stuff and right now i just feel so good so it's just kind of and i was telling ricardo this and he was like it just goes to show like even on your worst days if you like push through you can like do the best things you've ever done before and i was like dude that's literally crazy because i feel so so good there's been days where i go to the gym and i'm motivated and then i do so bad yeah not too and long today i didn't that. feel like going but i was like i have to and i did so good so that was just like a little word of advice at the very beginning of the video just in case you're having a bad day we all have those bad days to just keep pushing if you push through a bad day who knows it might be like one of the best days in whatever you're doing in life is that how they say there's a rainbow after the storm yes so exactly. just keep pushing whatever you're doing and sun's coming out right literally now, as so. soon as you said that the yeah, sun so came out just keep doing what you're doing just keep pushing no matter if it's hard if you're upset just the other day edith was getting really mad because she couldn't run on the treadmill and i told her your frustration and your angerness is absolutely gonna do nothing to you but just make you angry at that moment yeah just pass through it you couldn't do it oh well just work on the next day and work on yourself exactly. but anyways going back to this video <laughs> we finna waste some money we are <laughs> oh, we're totally. gonna go shopping for colorado because we are leaving to colorado this video is being pre-filmed so i'm not sure when it's exactly it's gonna go up but we are leaving on wednesday the 14th which is a literally right around the corner yep. aka one week away for you guys probably like tomorrow or something <laughs> we need to get prepared for this colorado trip we're going to a colorado cabin trip with all of our friends are you guys excited for I all the content so excited. we need clothes we need and clothes. we need to be prepared and we need to buy gifts if we find some but that's not like the main focus of the video we're probably gonna buy gifts in another video yep but let's go here we go that'll do it not use this door what's wrong with not that one. Oh, okay it breaks <laughs> that'll do it that'll do it you're coming home with me you're coming home with me look at this oh my you're gonna wear a shirt under that hey yo this gives me like candy cane vibes right shit okay i see your vision i see your vision okay damn it is getting lucky right now that's so cute and not even that guys 50 percent off add it to the pile thank you you're just about to shed a tear right now this, this is, is a jacket I really, really want. Like this exact color. They just have this one. Yep, a just a small. Look at this vibe ass sweater. This is a vibe. This one's a vibe. Look what we just fucking found. Oh my god, I love this one. Oh my god! Wow! <gasps> Oh my god. Sheesh. You look so good, baby. I love it. I love the design. Hey. <laughs> Alrighty, now it's time to go try everything on. Okay, first fit. Not too bad, not too bad. Popping both, shorts and the shirt. Oh, super duper cute, baby. I think it's super cute. So she's not just taking this pair, she's taking these as well. well look at all this, bro. How much do you think we're gonna spend? We're stuck. How much do you think we're gonna spend right now? 180. I say 250. Oh. Taking a little break. Yes. So. Alright, we're finished with our food. Next stop, Nike. So Edith found some joggers that she liked. We waited in line for like 20, 25 minutes maybe. And we just left out because she didn't want them after all. I didn't love them. You were forcing me to get them. I 
Because you were like, I have 25% off. 25 dollars off. But we waited in line Oopsie. and we wasted 25 minutes. Oopsies, let's go somewhere else. Oh. Just made it a Gilligan and eat it already loving Maybe stuff. Oh, also, I invited Gabby. Gabby's in town. So I told her she wanted to come shopping with us and she said, yeah. Maybe we'll see her. Maybe. Peter just wanted. found the color she wanted. Oh, extra, extra small. small. Extra large. D put it on top, put it on top, put it on top, put it on top, put it on top. Our luggage is gonna be maxed. <gasps> Super cute, bub. We spent 20 minutes looking for a PJ that know. they didn't have her size. Didn't have we did take her jacket. And I had three five dollar rewards. Ah uh, yeah, fifteen dollars off of this jacket. Oh my god, let's go. We're having some technical difficulties. They're here, but they're in the total opposite side that we're at. They do not know this mall at all. So we're gonna go look. Not even I do. Bruh. Where are they at? Guys, I see them. They're right there. They saw us. No, they didn't. <laughs> okay, now we're going to the expensive stores, North Face. Look, oh, they have a sale. Fuck yeah, this is so shit. Damn, I already found something. They're gonna take it, babe? 2XO, oversized hood. Oh, cute. All right, so we're in the last store. We're in the fitting room right now. We have a lot of stuff. And this is officially the last store because we've spent way too much money. But we came into North Face and they have a, like a 50% sale on. So we're taking joggers. Taking those this ones, one. these ones. Okay, I'm taking like three sweaters. <laughs> Don't be rude. Bye. Welcome to my crib. Welcome to my closet. Welcome to my closet. You guys, we posted a video of our closet and to be completely honest, it didn't come out like I wish it would have. But we did film that closet video and during that time, it was literally so chaotic that we had a lot of work in the back end and just this was just super stressful. So when I was organizing the closet, I had no energy to put up a face. You know how when you record, you have to be in a good energy, in a good space. And in that moment, I was just too sleepy. Because we were filming that like at 1 a.m. Point is, it didn't come out how I wanted it to come out. So here it is. This is what ideally would have been the ending of that video in this video. We're gonna show you guys pretty much everything that we bought today. And also like pretty much how everything is organized and everything. Because also in the last video I showed you guys me organizing my drawers but like nothing else. So here are all of our bags. We went ham at Forever 21 and North Face where the two stores we pretty much just went to. I have a couple of days to still go shopping for more stuff. So if you guys think I need something let for the snow, the please let me know. Okay, so I got these boots. They're super cute. I don't know about them. Ah, they're pink. I got them from Forever 21. And I also got these ones. These are the white ones. And this is how the bottom looks. I don't think these are snow boots, but we will be using them in the snow, ideally. That one was the one that I got from Hollister. It was $60, $60. because of my coupons, ayy! Because originally it was like $80. Not even that. We could kind of match. Oh my god, yes, baby! We could kind of match. I love, I, like, I am in love with this jacket. That is so cute, my love. I, love. I'm super glad you got that. The problem is, where in this closet are we going to put these two jackets? I think I'm going to wear this one going, like in the airplane. Do you have a cushion right here so you Dude, can Dude, you're not, you don't even fit without the, the freaking jacket. With you know it. what this reminds me of? What? The Simpsons. Oh, yeah. Fun fact, I've never watched The Simpsons before. Next. Oh, this is the from North Face. Dude, I am nice. in love with this stuff. This one's super nice. Fun fact, Edith North didn't know until Gabby told her that there was something on the back of the sweater. I didn't. I got it because of the front. Yeah. Cute. North Face part one. North Face part dose. I didn't even try this on. I hope it fits. Part tress. Part thress. These joggers aren't even going to fit me, but Ricardo got the X, 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 L. Part Just four. Kidding. Got another pair of sweats, an extra large, because Edith has like a dozen already. But I wanted them. North Face. This is the stuff that I got from Forever 21. Simple. This is a knitted sweater. And a little um turtleneck with. And this one. Oh, I forgot about this one. It's so cute. Yep. And that's the last of it. That was the end of our haul. So pretty much all we really need to buy. We already have like gloves. We already have. Where well, I don't even know where they're at. Okay, we lost the gloves. We might need to buy new ones. The only thing I need is no pants. And anything I need is no boots. We'll work on that in the next couple of days. But without further ado, let me show you guys how the closet looks. And everything actually fit in here. In the closet video, a lot of people were saying that we have so much shit. And we do have a lot of shit. And it's like so cluttered but after this closet renovation it just feels so much less cluttered everything feels organized now the only thing is these new jackets we just bought we probably won't have any space nope. for so we'll probably have to declutter or figure out some sort of other organization hack for those but other than that everything pretty pretty much fits really well this is my space and my space only because either took all the other ones <laughs> it's but only 
one. Dude, why are you such a fucking hater? Oh, oh by the way, this one's um, this one's mine. Squatties? The squatties. I haven't worn it yet. I'm gonna take this from you because you don't even wear it. It's because I haven't had time, but dude, it's I'm repping the Sinaloa. Oh, shout hey. out to Juarez. Shout out to Juarez. And then me and Edith are also sharing this bottom one with Pretty our... much it's all you. You want to count? <laughs> no, 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 Two, don't count. Three. And here, my favorite Cute. section of them all. One carries six pairs of shoes. But then Ida's purse is, look at her fucking taking a whole ass fucking... This is your duffel bag. This is your... Oh, yeah. And then all of Edith's must clothes. Stop! We have Jim, PJ, graphic, graphic tees, tees sweatpants, yep. joggers, and, and pants. pants. And all of Ricardo's stuff is in... <laughs> Get shows! All of your stuff, tell more time. We had all the drawers like in the back of the wall, and we ended up moving it in the room, and we took off Edith's nightstand, so now I have all my clothes in our room. Yeah, let me show y'all real quick. Over there. That's my new nightstand, and Ricardo's clothes are all in there. What the <laughs> fuck is that? And last then, last but not, but not least, least, we got this, this big giant ass. Please do not touch it with your musty crusties. <laughs> but as you could tell, it is a ginormous difference. It is a humongous, humongous difference. Difference. We love it, and we can't wait. Well, actually, we've already been enjoying yep. it for uh, some time now. We've just been doing TikToks and stuff. Like <laughs> yeah, I have. Follow me on the TikTok. I'm so glad we actually ended up doing this. Even though it was such a chaos doing this. Yeah, even though, and then like, even though the, the video didn't come out like I wanted it because I was so stressed out and so tired. But now we're doing it, and yep. now we're showing you guys, and yep. it's amazing, and I can't wait to. I have a dream closet with so much more storage. And you guys can stop telling me that I have so much clutter because I love clothes and I love shoes and I can't help myself <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, that's pretty much it for today's vlogmas vlog. We'll see you guys tomorrow for Wait, yet again Sorry, 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 We'll see you guys tomorrow for yet again another vlogmas vlog. Bye!